What's up, guys? It has been a minute since I've recorded. I'm back in Utah. Markel actually comes home in two days. And while she's been away, I've been really talking her into try doing something. And I did. Kina, do you want to show up to people what, what we talked Mama into? Come here. Let's talk. Let's talk. Should I show them? Should we show them? Oh, you can kind of see it behind me. Are you going to get baby sister? Yeah, are you going to get baby sister? Mm-hmm. You're going to get baby sister, huh? I talked Markel into getting a new puppy. And we get her Saturday. So Markel gets home Thursday. And then we go get our little girl on Saturday. Uh, he has been staring at this cage, mostly because he wants the toys that are inside. And we might end up having to give him one because he won't leave the cage alone. And he keeps pawing at it and whining and crying because he just wants a toy so bad, even though you have 50 toys upstairs. You have so many toys. You don't need baby sister's toys. Today's the day. First of all, look who I found at the airport. My mom. She's home, finally. And today is the day that we fill this cage with our little girl. We're going to go pick her up right now. She doesn't know how she feels about it. All right, let's go get her. All right, we've picked up. Our package, little girl right there, still undecided on a name. Kina is doing okay. He's doing okay. He's doing all right. I think it's just gonna take a few days to realize that she's not going anywhere. Yeah. He's scaring her, which is the bad part, cause he's- A little overbearing. He's a little overbearing. But you're doing good. Better than you thought he would do? Yeah. What's interesting is puppies just tend, like, puppies have actually always freaked him out. Not in like an aggressive way, they've always made him nervous. Like, anytime he's been around a puppy puppy, like tiny puppy, he kind of like drools a lot. He's not doing that with her, which is good. He's not like nervous about her. He's more like, I can't tell if he wants to like play but he's a little too rough right now because he's a lot bigger and thicker than her. So I can't really tell if he's wanting to play with her or not like her. <laughs> but he's actually doing really well. He wants to, I think, get in there with her right now. Not happening. We need a break, dude. Not happening. She was shaking. I'm scared her. Is she my baby sister? You doing good though? Yeah, you're doing so good. Yeah, we got this pen to kind of be able to split them up while we adjust to the fact that she's not going anywhere. I'm sorry, you can't get in there. You're a little too rough right now. You're a little too rough. Overall, though, like, I think it went really well with him for the first day. Yeah. He's doing good. Yeah. Later we'll go on like a joint W-A-L-K with both of them so he knows like, see she brings good things. Associate positive, huh? Cause you were getting T-R-E-A-T's. Yeah. And being a boy. Yeah. Yeah. Um, for baby sister. So overall, off to a good start. Any time you watching sister eat, he's doing so good. He likes to bully her a little bit, but like playful. Yeah. Like it's just that like he's a little too aggressive, and like he likes to play rough, so he'll like run and like jump in front of her and Arrah! type of. He reminds me of the freaking Grinch, of like. Arrah! Like scare her. Yeah, that's scare her a little bit. We did, however, attempt a walk today on a leash. Uh, it's a big no. From it her. went about as expected as a puppy on a leash. So, he and I just like, 
He's not a good walker. He's like, a terrible he walker. He holds really bad, but he never, like, didn't know how to walk on a leash. Yeah. Because we didn't use a leash for a while until we were in an apartment that required dogs be on a leash. And by that point, he just, like, knew to just, like, walk. Like, it wasn't an issue. But so far, these, these two are, aren't doing too bad. She's pottying outside, which the people we got her from were already starting potty training. So she's really, like, learned to be good at, at, at going. So you want your water? You want your water? You cry if you're in there, you cry if you're not in there. Oh, are you just going to sleep? Which one are you doing? I think we're going to go give her a bath. I'm going to give you your first bath, huh, sister? We still haven't decided on a name. Markel posted on our Instagram story, to, or a post today, eight years ago today is to when, the to the day, is when we got that little idiot standing behind me. We went, we drove almost two hours, so four hours round trip to pick up our $50 purchase. And he was about worth ever, all $50. <laughs> Maybe 48. Yeah. He was, he, he was actually a very, 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 very easy puppy. Very easy. So we're a little nervous that we just got super lucky with Kenai because he was very easy.